Hello guys, it's Gordon here again and today I'm going to show you how to fix the black screen in case you download the uh, display drivers and you get a black screen. Yeah, I'm going to show you how to fix it. So after installing the display drivers, the screen goes black. Well, if you actually look at it very closely, the screen is not entirely black. You might probably want to take it out into the sun and try and see, but it's, it's not entirely black, right? So all you gotta do is try and uh, come to the notification area right here right? and try and adjust the brightness. It will be all the way back here but try and bring it uh, all the way to the front right. Or if you can't do that, you just push the F12 button on your keyboard. Uh, I'm using the Lenovo Tengu so it's the F12 button. I don't know which button you also be on but Look for any button that has a brightness symbol on it, so you just push that to adjust, like right here, right? Or if that doesn't work too, then um, you bring your mouse to the bottom left corner, right? And just drag just a few centimeters, right? Just make sure your mouse is on the, the search button. I know, I know you are doing this blind, but just type CMD, right? Alright, so after restarting your computer will um, load to this screen and you just come down to um, troubleshoot, right? Hit enter. Then you come to advanced options. Then you go to startup settings. Alright, then you um, forgive my camera resolution, alright? Just trying to focus. Then you hit enter, right? Alright, so when it comes, you just you want to go to uh, enable safe mode. Alright, so it says number four right there, so you, you push F4. F4. Alright, so after loading, you just input your password. Alright, uh, you just input your password. Alright, so now when it loads to the it boots into the safe mode. You want to come to the search bar down here. You want to search device managers. Alright, you want to search device managers. So you come to the display adapters right here, then you uninstall it. Alright, you uninstall your driver yeah. so after uninstalling it that will take you back to the Microsoft basic adapter and after I think you have to probably try searching the internet for a compatible that is if all these don't work right for a compatible display adapter for your PC yeah I hope this helps and thank you very much